Dark chocolate M&Ms are one of my favorite treats. I used to think that every color had a different flavor. Also as a kid, the red M&Ms went away for about 10 years because of a 1971 Russian study that linked red dye number two to cancer. And of course, M&Ms was using red dye number 40, which posed no threat to human health, but Mars still removed it to avoid customer confusion. Then in 1987, the red M&M made a comeback, thanks to Paul Hethman, who, while a freshman at the University of Tennessee, created a mail-in membership called the Society for the Restoration and Preservation of the Red M&M. His society went viral, which in the 80s meant it hit newspapers, radios, and television, creating a massive outcry that reached the Mars company. The red M&M came back to the US still using dye number 40. But in Europe, red M&Ms use a natural dye that is made from crushed up bugs. 